good morning everybody and as you can see it's just me this morning it's just me and Bo in it Bo today Catherine's got something wrong with her so she's not very well this morning she's not been very well all night long and to top it all off this morning we get up uh, to make a cup of tea and I uh, noticed there a bit of water on the floor uh, everything in the freezer and the fridge defrosted and for, for whatever reason I don't know if it's I don't know if it was the wind because as, our, as I'm sat here the wind was coming straight this way you probably see them wind turbines in the distance um, blowing in <coughs> and I think it's just get a bump. the flame the shields there what stops the wind but I switched it off this morning put it back on and it's fired up so not quite sure what's gone off there but we've just been to um, farm foods and put a load of stuff in the freezer but we've still got a few bits which is still frozen but I don't know all those salmon defrosted so we're not going to keep all that salmon in the freezer this is all defrosted so we're going to have to try and cook all that today aren't we buddy? Hmm? so we're not doing very well this morning plans what we planned on doing uh, anyway where we're stopping at the minute it's called the wee shop at the window it's like a what do you call them yeah it's a farm shop this and they allow you to stay overnight for £10 a night there is a toilet and a shower in that building across there there's a water tap across there that's pretty much it really but it's out of the way on a B road just south of Thurso so we had a quiet night's sleep here well apart from Catherine getting up and down not very well she's in the bathroom sorting the sun out um, we're going to get moved this morning because uh, as usual everything in the van's about flat uh, we're hoping the fridge is going to be alright now but yeah it's one of them days I think it's going to be one of them days isn't it Bill we've got no salmon for Boo's breakfast because that's obviously been in a warm fridge so we don't give him that but the stuff that's defrosted was still really cold so we'll get that cooked later on for you won't we buddy yeah and uh, yeah we're gonna make a move a bit further across towards Smooth's cave so uh, keep watching and see if we actually make it there or if we actually even move today she's here look i'm here just i'm feeling a little bit better now but oh. it's been a rough night i will say one thing about this place the breakfast rolls in that little cabin there are banging the food is I've just been talking, I've just been to get Zach some breakfast and she's there, she, I said, oh, what? she says, do you want to take over for a minute while you're waiting? She's there stirring this pan and I said, oh, what is it? She's cheese sauce, she says, everything's handmade here. Mm. Um, I had sausage and bacon, £3.10 in a roll and the proper sausages, yeah. not them frozen things, yeah. proper, proper sausages. Yeah, so, yeah they're, they're ever so nice, the girls here as well, they're lovely. They uh, got even got a little garden centre up yeah. there. So yeah, we was question, questioning our... Uh, What's the word? I don't know. Decision to stop here? Just decisions in life this morning. <laughs> We're going to farm yeah. foods over there and stock the freezer I full. I know you could probably, what you're going to say is we can cook most of it. We can, but there's that much we can't cook it all, so we've had to bin some. The thing so. is, chicken worries me and it was actually warm and yeah. I would never, that, that it just Everything goes in the chicken's bin. gone it's, in the bin. Yeah. Salmon was really cold. The salmon can be saved, we can cook it all and we mm. can use it for sandwiches and stuff. We're Give Boo a little bit salmon extra. For a month and, now. Yeah. The, if you can see the, that wind turbine, the wind is coming straight this way and straight in there and I presume that's how it's... I presume we it should have thought on, we should have turned the van round, no. shouldn't we? But well, we haven't had no trouble before, but... No. It's strange this morning because I shielded it with my body and it lit straight away, but it wasn't lit when mm. I was in the van. So I've cleaned it out and put it back on. It seems to be getting cold again now. Yeah. Well, let me listen to it. Yeah, I can hear it roaring in there, so we know that's all right. Mm -hmm. But is his breakfast ready yet? He's got it. He's eating it. Oh right. Yeah, yeah, he's got it. Oh, let me show you. <laughs> let me show you sausages. Is your sausages hanging out your bun? A little bit. They got no, no sauce on them. Oh no, you have to put your own sauce on. Ooh. Yeah, proper. Oh, mine were bigger than them. Yours were loads bigger. Proper sausages. Let's get you some pouches. Very yummy. We've run out of ketchup, so I need to get. I, luckily, I keep pouches. I was going to say they've got pouches over there. Have they? Yeah, so we've decided we're going to head towards Smooth's Caves. It's only about 60 odd mile, but it says two and a half hours now mm, this morning. Because of the roads, isn't it? Yeah, it looks like... like being back in Ireland. 
it probably I don't know we'll find out in a minute but we need to get some charge in the van mm. so we're going to set off and then hopefully Catherine will feel a bit more human mm. in a short while than I did earlier you tossed me like a stone you swept me off my feet I can feel my bones I still count the days Swept me off my feet I keep going high, she keeps going low Something feels wrong right now, I know Something feels wrong You don't wait for me, cause I keep breathing fire I won't wait for you, cause you keep telling lies I keep going high, she keeps going low At the end of the day, she's gone road we came down there was quite a bit of driving footage in there I'll admit but wow what roads that's just took us two and a half hours to get 68 mile I think it was but <laughs> we've come here to Smoo Cave which is um, just over that way there is parking down there but this is for motor homes up here but they've got washing machines here as well <laughs> so if you need your washing and I think Catherine says you can stop here Overnight cashier registration on Cheers and pay for parking. But it keeps saying card reader rebooting for some reason. So, yeah, you've got this uh, big car park to park motor homes in. Not sure what this is offering, it must be like a cafe or something or a little shop. when it's open hmm. so we're not going to take Boo down because there's a lot of steps to go up and down so Zach's just taking him around the car park stretch his legs otherwise we'll have to carry him back up there because uh, I think there's quite a few steps right let's do this uh, 350 to park in there but if you want uh, card payment don't work it says go to the takeaway which is short <laughs> Takeaway. Yeah, it says what's the takeaway behind you? Ah, oh, right. Uh, yeah, that it, little hut. Yeah. But it does take coins. Let's walk across here. Yes, it? but sadly, I don't have any coins. Yeah, we've we've only got twenty pound notes. What was our bank? And we've not about twenty five pence in silver. That's it. We've not broke into them yet. <laughs> I think it's out of season. Nobody, yeah. Nobody's bothered. But there is a car park down here, but only for smaller vehicles. Yeah, we feel a bit happy now we've driven across them epic roads, don't we? Oh, yes. But single carriageway for two hours. It's been quite a drive, hasn't it? A beautiful scenery, as you've probably oh, just yeah. seen. Absolutely stunning. Well, yeah, we can't bypass smooth caves. 
<clears throat> and I'm not taking the dog poo for a walk. There's just no bins up there. <laughs> I wonder what these will look like, old like army type Oh, they do, don't they? Yeah, this is the lower car park, which is... Yeah, we're, we'd have had to go across there and take everybody's space up, wouldn't we? Yeah. But there is we'll go to bins down here. We'll go to the bin. There is a public toilets here as well. I think we need to go down that way over there. Or is it that way? That way. It better not rain. We've not come equipped for rain. We've come equipped to look. <laughs> We've got coats, so... Yeah, we are. Right. A few info boards. They do do a tour. Mm. Oh, is that, what does that say there? Due to lack of signal. <laughs> yeah, it's free to go and look around. 365 days a year. If you want to do a tour, I think they ended in October or something. What can we see down? Oh, there's several, several ways down then. Cause there's there must be, because there's a lot of stairs over there. That's the way down there. This way to the bottom. Hope you're feeling better for getting back up. I know. Mm. I'm not missing it though. I might. I'll just have to keep stopping. No drone zone. Is this not too bad though? Because it's not sure. Like one step instead of. Oh, these. Steps, these. Yeah. These are the worst steps. Where the long the ones. Big steps. I think. I have brought a drink though. Wait till we come back up, Zaki. <laughs> Make I your know. legs burn. They're big steps, them ones. Big steps for short legs. These are proper <laughs> big steps. But it is sheltered from the wind down here, so that's a good thing. Oh, well, you could get in there, look. Is that it? Do we have to go any further? Is that the cave? Yeah, you go in there. We'll go to the bottom. There's, a, there's an ice cream van down here, Zach. Oh, is there? Good. <laughs> we made it to the bottom. It's not, it's not as far down as what you think, is it? I know no. it's a long way back. I'll ask you that when you go back up. No, it ain't. Look. It's just one big ginormous rock there. <laughs> and here's the cave entrance. I'm not sure how far we can actually get in there. Or whether I should have brought a light for the camera. Whoa! From side to side. Did you? I yes, thought, I knew it did, and I wasn't going to tell you, you bugger. Oh, it is. Yes, it does. <laughs> I've, uh, I've felt ill enough just lately without you doing that. Oh, I was walking then, thinking I feel a bit drunk. <laughs> oh, it rock a little bit. Yeah. Rock? It feels like it's going to fall over. <laughs> it does. It still looks. Look at it wobbling. <laughs> yeah. I just think the road goes over the top of it, doesn't it? Yeah, but that's off I've seen a pigeon. Pigeons like it down you know, here, nesting up, nesting up there. Look at the water. Beautiful. Can go up there if you want. <laughs> nice and cool in here. Bridge doesn't wobble as much. <laughs> no, that one wobbles like anything. Oh, I can go down through there, but looks right. Oh, okay. Oh, I can still feel that bridge wobbling. Nice. I'm hoping the phone thought stuff is just this. Oh, I can feel a right draft coming through here. It's quite dark in here. Oh. You guys can't feel this, and there's a pigeon up there, can't feel it on the camera, but there's a right draft coming through here. You can go through there in a boat, yeah. on the tours. 
So should have brought the uh, light, but hopefully the Hopefully you can pick it up all right. It's magnificent, isn't it? Smooth caves. We made it here. Hey, we I, mind, made it. I wouldn't mind coming doing a tour at some stage where you go out there on the boat. It'd be good that, wouldn't it? Mm. I don't know how far it goes, but it looks good. I've got to watch some videos. It goes off that way, it goes off that way, so I'm imagining it goes very far. I'll have to watch some videos on YouTube later. Mm. Shows you I'm digging it out, doesn't it? Yeah, we recently discovered an academic hole. <laughs> Rather them than me, it looks a bit mm. tight in there. Mm. Yeah, very young lad, though, isn't it? Oh, <laughs> Can you hear your pigeons? We're just saying, best time to come now. One, one other person in there with us. That's it. You come in summertime, I bet, I bet you just can't get any good pictures of it. No. Well, you know, good luck when there's all people around. I've only spent two minutes, my legs are shaking. Oh, they're still shaking when they get on that bridge. Oh, no. <laughs> Proper wibbly wobbly. Pigeons like it in there anyway, don't they? Mm, there's a lot of them. Them steps are going to be current way up. Some of them steps down bottom are massive. They're like up to your, near, up to your shoes. But another cave over there, look. I don't know. That's it, you party soon now, I'll run to the top. Off you go. Um, we've been told about a co uh, place to get hot chocolates, haven't we? Just right yes, Cocoa Mountain. Cocoa Mountain. And quite a lot of people have recommended it. So. We believe there's a motorhome stop there with electric <coughs> for 15 quid. There is, yeah. So we're going to go and have a look, see if it's true and if we can get in, etc. Yeah. Uh, well, hopefully we can. Yeah, hopefully so. Right, all we've got to do is get back up these steps. Well, that, I just know it's that winch there. They used to winch fishing boats up with that. From the sea down there, yeah. I think it was sat around corner somewhere. Yeah. It's just there now, and you just pull them in up onto this beach. Oh. This will burn off a calorie. Only one. Only one. Give you one and a quarter. Not enough for a hot chocolate. Oh no. <laughs> You'd have to go up and down here about 100 times to burn one of them off. Yeah. Watch them be shut today. I know. Nice day for it. Yeah, it's just right. You wouldn't want to come up there in summer, you'd be sweating then. No, wouldn't you just? We've got a nice cold breeze, it just. Yeah. I think it's it better. It? Yeah. I'm not out of breath from walking up there at all, it's just in the legs. So what else was around here then? Digging deeper. Cave. And it's naturally formed, hasn't it, as always? Yes. From yeah. erosion. Just a few different boards. Telling you about it. A bit of a picnic area. Then beautiful mountains in the distance. Catherine's got a bit of info on the winch. Yeah, no, it just says um, the winch can be seen on shore, which was used to haul small boats above the high water mark. The 18th century ruin you can see was used for storing fishing equipment. Smoo continued to be used by fishermen into the 20th century. Mm. There you go. All right, so we're actually right at the top left of Scotland now, aren't we? We are, yeah. Um, I'll show you on the map when we get back to the van. Mm -hmm. just, gotta, just gotta get up that hill now. Right up there somewhere. <laughs> yeah where that red building is. Right, I'll just give you a quick look where we are on the map. Obviously we started down here in Inverness, we've come up all the way around there. We was down here last night and we've come all the way across to near Durness. So all that road. And we're going to have a look at a motor home stop just around the corner, a couple of miles away. Because <sighs> we're not sure that the fridge is actually I've it. Um, <coughs> working very well. Doesn't, doesn't Nothing feel, just right? seems to be very cold. The flame is not normally hear it roaring, it's not roaring, no. so I'm a bit uh, Well if push comes to shove we'll have to do some of it on the fridge. They weren't yeah stuff's defrosted even more I think. Yeah. Oh dear. <sighs> Lovely. Blooming thing. Right, let's go to this motor home there. At least we can get an electric and put the fridge on. Yeah. That's one thing, isn't it? 
At least beer don't go off. That's the main thing. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> have to get all that salmon cooked. It's salmon for salmon breakfast, for, salmon yeah. for dinner, salmon for tea. Yeah, and breakfast and dinner and tea tomorrow. Yep. Right, so we've come a bit further down the road to the. They call it a motor home there. It's not. They don't look like it's a not. motor home there, but it's fifteen quid with electricity. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, and that's what we need. And we could do with charging up and have a look at the fridge on. We'll put it on electric for now, so. Yeah, this is it. Not much to look at. We could just tap to get water somewhere. We've got the uh, sea over that way. But yeah, I think that's all due. I think we're leaning quite a bit though. Yeah, what about going down next to that static? Yeah, I suppose I could do bit flatter isn't it? Yeah I'll move across then. Good idea let's add kettle on. Yeah I'm ready for a coffee. Ready for something. I'll tell you what it might look like Beirut out here but 15 quid of electric. You can't fault that can you? You can't get I'm like, I don't, don't anybody can get any cheaper in the UK. No. Um, I'll have to have a look at what's up with this fridge I don't know. I might even look see if we can get a new fridge because it's just letting us down all the time. Uh, but them, them roads we've come across, if you have to come on the NC500, all the way up to Wick, it's fine, isn't it? Yeah. Wick to John O'Groats, the roads are a bit... Um, and then from John O'Groats to Thurso, weren't too bad, but from Thurso across to where we are now... Yeah, it switches to these, like, passes, doesn't it? Some really rough roads, narrow, um, big, big, big <laughs> holes in them yeah. places. And you know, it's in van all the time, and I don't think that's helped the fridge no. one little bit. No. Uh, they're proper van wrecking roads, aren't they? No, I think we need to invest in a new fridge. I think we need to invest in a new van. <laughs> <laughs> what do you reckon, Boo? I'm fed up, I'm not going nowhere now. <laughs> You're a good boy, aren't you? Poor thing. He yeah, you because know, it's it's noisy on them roads. You know, you know it's like in a motor. Oh, this motor was quite good. If we yeah. didn't eat contique, it would have oh, been deafening. That would have been ridiculous. Um, so yeah, he don't like the loud like, roads, does he? No. But it's like, what do you do? Can't do what do you do, buddy? Yeah. We'll get you some fresh salmon cooked in a minute, and you can have a bit it's for on. your have a bit for your din din. My little cookers on. Oh, I might fancy salmon for dinner. Might <laughs> oh, yeah, that's a good job, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, and tea. And breakfast. Ah, so we need to have a look through the fridge right. and sort out what's. Uh, no, we've really took stuff out of the fridge, haven't we? Oh. Yeah, that's, most of it I think will be all right. That's in the fridge. I've been looking at. Um, did I tell them I've been looking at compressor fridges? No, you told me. I think I told Catherine. Yeah, yeah you, a, you told a, me as we were leaving. A, a big one like that. Yeah, but the downside to them is they can use like forty-four. Um, Amps a day, so yeah, it's, it's a, a lot, lot of power, isn't it? Yeah, them bits are alright because that was that big piece we got. Yeah, they're it? fine. Oh, look at all that bits of salmon, though. Yeah, luckily enough, they've just defrosted slowly because the freeze has obviously gone off mm -hmm. yesterday. I was just thinking as well, we've done really, really well with this freezer. We've not touched it for. Mm. I don't That's think we touched it in Ireland. Yeah. We haven't touched it for ages, and then get that steaming. Right, rather than sitting van moping around, we're going to have a little walk down to a beach down here. Yeah. Nine, nine minute walk apparently, so... Yeah, it says it's not far. It's not not be long before it's dark, so it's like, I know. let's just get out. The sun's been beaming though, hasn't it? Mm. Slow down you, because you're not of energy to walk back. Come here. Look at this old tractor here, she's been... I think she's come to end of her life. <laughs> If only they could talk and tell a story. That's the Perkins. I don't even know what tractor it is. It's a Perkins, it's a little Perkins diesel engine, isn't it? Hmm. Yeah. Somebody do it up. Oh, oh yeah. yeah, the beach is literally just over there. Bit of a path to walk down. And uh, various locks all over, isn't there? There is. Oh, look at the sun coming through the clouds. Or should I say, lock? Lock. There's some geese over there. <laughs> mm. We come past some fields full of geese. Oh, I bet there was a thousand geese in one field. I bet there were ten thousand. There were thousands. There was. There was uh, the most I've ever seen in one place. Mm. I think it must have been a bit of a 
they? resting place on. Yeah, they migrate get, that way, don't they? They migrate, so. don't they? So. Yeah, not too far down here. Looks like we're probably up beach to ourselves as well. Yeah. So uh, we can just go down and de stress out a bit. Yeah. What do you reckon? I'm quite happy we've got in here on electric though for the for the price. I mean yeah. they can't grumble at that, crikey. Yeah, we've got eating on, yeah. van charge up, get back, back charged up. That's it. Yeah, it's not pretty but Well it's not, but it serves a, a purpose, doesn't it? And yeah. It gives us chance somewhere to park so we can just sort a few things out. And have a look where to go tomorrow. Yeah. Do it all again in the morning. Ugh. Yeah. Try and figure out fridge. <laughs> yeah. We've got some escapee sheep, I think. <laughs> Some are this side of the fence. Yeah. Um, that sheep's just flung itself off a wall, the one that was in the middle of the road. What are you doing? <laughs> it's like, um, I'm not sure how to get back to the other side. Yeah, oh, and this one, look here. Yeah, I know. Oh, hello. Oh, don't panic, Mr. Sheepy. Don't panic. Looks like it must have come through. I don't know. Oh, they're proper escape artists, aren't the sheep? Yeah, you can see where he's chucked all the cylinder down, but where he's just come off at war. Hmm, he jumped over there. Okay. I presume we've got to go down here and round to get to the beach. Oh, we've got a bit of a walk back up here, Bill. Yeah. <laughs> Them two are off down there. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that beach, Bill. Oh, yeah. Bal... Ni Bal Nikhil. Bal Nikhil Bay. Bal Bay. That's where we are. Dog walkers, uh, also got to use the big gate. <laughs> Listen to that water. <laughs> Sounds beautiful. Look at this bay. Look at this. Look at this beach. Oh, I'm in heaven, Dad. I think we'll have to maybe just walk around down there. We've got to go around this way. Otherwise we can't get across down there. Hello, Dad. Hello. Hello, everybody. Hello. Oh, look at that sand. <laughs> That's beautiful. I think the sheep's come down here as well. <laughs> That's one happy pooch. Look at the colour of that water. Do you know what? It might be a bit of a, a dive up there where we park, but... It's blooming beautiful down here. Where else do you get for 15 you know quid? You for a paddle look. Like this. <laughs> 15 quid. How you could probably walk it, couldn't you? Yeah, just across in the next just, village. Yeah. Look at the sand here, where it's... <laughs> and the water's... Uh... <laughs> I bet not too close to the edge, or so I'll end up with you. He'll be down there. <laughs> Wet and, and sandy. I'll be laughing. Yeah. There's a golf course up there. Yeah. Well, I can see some flags. Oh, right. you know. Look at that, Bill. And the water's just come straight in there. Oh, I love it, Mum. <laughs> All these sniffs. That oh, water's coming in, isn't it? It is coming in there. Keep an eye on that. Quite soft to get up. How to make Boo happy in one easy step. Bring him to a beach. Where are you going, buddy? Oh, this is uh, proper. Yeah, very soft. That's what. Oh, look out! Oh. It's coming in quite. I presume it is coming in. Yeah. yeah. It doesn't look like it gets much higher than this. Look, this is like the water line, oh, isn't no. it? Oh Looks like they bring boats down here. Yeah. Come up that way. I don't think the camera picks up the colour of the water. I think we'd need the drone so you could see down. Yeah. It's proper turquoise, isn't it? Well, the weather's certainly turned. It was yeah. sunny when we come down. I know, it's raining now. Have well, a quick look at this church ruins. Oh, I'm so glad I found this part What's this? Uh, Ministry of Defence. Yeah, that's just Cape Wrath, just like a bit further up the coast, isn't it? Firing area. Hmm. Cape Wrath. Firing. Hmm. Okay. See a bit of wildlife around here. 
from that old church there. Most of the oyster catchers have got that on the beach, have they? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I didn't realise that. Beautiful sunshine when we set off. I know! But you could see this coming in, look behind you, over the mountains. You My nose it. is cold. It's runny nose weather now. <laughs> it is runny nose weather. No, we just have a quick gander down here. There's no point rushing back to the van. We've got our coats on. Quick gander, bull. Right, just as take care. Yeah. We're having uh, memorial inspections. I see gate posts <laughs> coming away. I know. One Greek post. Oh. These gates are nice. Yeah, the old ruins of the church. Very pretty. Don't rain. No, please don't rain. Quite a few Campbells in here. McDonald's as well. McDonald's. The old church ruins. Oh look. Huh. Still got a bit in here, hasn't yeah. it? Yeah. Oh wow, look at all the engraving on that. Huh. Oh, wow. Gosh. Oh no. It's like that bit's just been built in corner, isn't it? I know. It's quite... They've reinforced it all with like breeze block, not breeze blocks, but. You know, like top's been made on yeah. the piece of cement in it. Yeah. You can see on the side where they've just. just to hold it up. I think that's enough exploring for today. <laughs> Let's get back to the van. But lights just starting to go now, isn't it? And have some more salmon. <laughs> <laughs> so we want to thank you all for watching. Yes. And uh, we'll see you tomorrow. See you Saturday. Oh, is this Thursdays? Yes, this is Thursdays video. So we'll, we'll see, see you, you on, tomorrow on the live. See you? No, it's not. Live's not for another week. Oh. It's live every two weeks. So. I give in. We'll see you Saturday. Yeah, see you Saturday.